Hi, this is Joe at Cable Guys. We teamed up again with Nicky Romero to bring you Kickstart 2, the fastest, easiest plugin for professional sidechain compression effects. With the same fast workflow as version 1, we've added new features like audio triggering, multi band ducking, and more. Now, Kickstart is just as useful for genres like hip hop, trap, and drum and bass as it is for house, techno, and EDM. So, in this tutorial, I'll walk you through Kickstart 2's controls and new features. For classic 4 to the floor sidechain ducking effects, Kickstart 2 has the same fast workflow as the original Kickstart. Load Kickstart 2 on the channel you want to sidechain. Default settings duck the bass's volume on every beat, allowing the kick to punch through and adding groove. Choose one of Nicky Romero's 16 preset sidechain curves, then use the big mix knob to set the strength or amount of ducking. New for Kickstart 2, you can now drag the curves slope left and right. Sync mode ducks every quarter, eighth, half or bar. But now we have a problem. The bass clashes with the kick when the kick pattern changes. With Kickstart 2's new audio triggering, you can now duck the signal every time the kick hits, no matter how complex the pattern. Just route your kick channel into the plugin's external sidechain input. To find out how to set up sidechaining in your particular door, check out the link in the description. Now switch to audio trigger mode and the sidechain curve restarts every time the kick hits. Fine-tuned for kicks and percussive material, the triggering is rock solid. The end marker sets where the sidechain curve stops. The audio remains at that value until it's triggered again. With your kick channel rooted into Kickstart 2's sidechain input, the new kick view feature overlays the kick drum on the oscilloscope in yellow. This works in sync and MIDI modes too. Use the kick and bass waveforms as a guide while you drag the new movable slope to lock the sidechain shape and groove with your kick. Kickstart 2 isn't just for obvious pumping effects. It can be used for invisible side chaining to make space in the mix without the listener noticing that one signal is moving out of the way of another. Let's duck this 808 when the kick hits, using audio triggering to follow the kick pattern. Use Kickstart 2's new band split to duck the low frequencies of a signal, leaving the mids and highs unducked. Simply turn on band and adjust the slider if needed. Kickstart 2 will dip the 808's frequencies below the cutoff point, leaving the mids and treble untouched. Here's another example using band split to keep this respace's mid range and high end presence while ducking the lows out of the way of the kick. Kickstart 2 can be used on any sound for creating space in the mix or for rhythmic effects. When pumping pads or synths, get creative with longer or shorter synced length values. Use the trim curves to add rhythm to a static sound. 
you can shift the entire curve with these arrows in large or fine increments. And use MIDI triggering to program unique gated patterns. To get Kickstart 2, upgrade or try the demo, head to kickstart-plugin.com.